Yeah, so this is a 10,000 kV air discharge on, uh, on an LK162-12 ESD enhanced, and this is a signal ground. All right, charged and delivered the shock. So you can see artifacting on the display. That's okay. No, we're not talking anymore. This could still be a result of the up to a, of the last test. The cable doesn't doesn't like these tests. USB port probably doesn't like these tests. USB port's fine. Hell. Oh. Damn laptop entirely ESD proof. Which is a kind of good constellation or consideration considering I shock everything in sight. Including yourself? Once or twice. It's magic. So send on screen on screen on the text. Perfect. Display survived. Okay, so now we're doing uh, fifteen thousand KV. Yep. Uh, air discharge on uh, the display. All right. All right. Display still alive. You see a clear screen. Can clear screen. You can see the artifacting in the center, and it's gone. Look at Rob Brian's magic finger. Just okay. taking the static charge off the glass. Yeah, I know. So now we're doing twenty thousand. Twenty thousand. Do twenty-five. Help. Yeah. Twenty-five thousand. Air discharge. Okay. Wow. Oh. Clear the screen. No. Yeah, uh, it's okay. So we once again we see artifacting, but the display is alive and functioning. Okay. All right, let's do thirty thousand. How high does this thing go? Thirty thousand. Okay, thirty thousand air discharge. On an LK one sixty two dash twelve ESD. Okay. <laughs> the screen. So again we see artifacting but we have displays alive, sent some text. Look at that. It's great. Anyways, okay. now did you want to do surface testing or just air discharge? This is fine. Right. I mean if this survives this it will survive it. Well surface testing is a lot harder. It's a lot harder on the display because it's a focal charge but their discharge is a lot more real world. Well, the first successful video is